Breaking overnight, police now confirm three people are dead and five more are hurt after a gunman opened fire on the campus of Michigan State University. In the past few hours, we learned the suspected shooter is also dead. New 6's Ezzie Castro is following the latest this morning. Ezzie. Bridget, you can imagine what a huge scare this was for students on campus last night. Many ran for their lives out of their dorms as police searched for the shooter, who police say had no connection to the university. This truly has been a nightmare that we are living tonight. Police at Michigan State University say a 43-year-old man opened fire on campus last night, killing three people and injuring five others. They say he later turned the gun on himself. The suspect in this incident was located outside of the MSU campus, and it does appear that that suspect has uh, died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Officers swarmed the campus within minutes of the first reports of an active shooter. This cell phone video shows multiple students running from their dorms. We were there locked in the rooms and the guys were telling us to run out the back door as quick as we can and run for our lives. And I sprinted out there as fast as I can into the woods. Investigators say the suspect was not a student or a staff member and are trying to figure out why he came to campus. What led the officers to come across him and contact him? We will determine that. That will be part of our investigation, but I'm not able to share that at this point. Investigators have not released the names of the victims, but we do know five of them are in the hospital in critical condition. The deputy chief said they should have another update later this morning. Crystal. Hezzy, thanks.